Hi, I'm Jenny. And I'm Scott. And we were with His People London from 97 to 2001. And I think back to my time at His People London, and I'm really thankful to God for that time because it really changed our life spiritually. It was a time where we made a real commitment to the Lord, and we were able to, in that environment, feel so nurtured and, and encouraged in our relationship with the Lord that it was a turning point, life-changing. And for me, it was like coming home. Even though we're a million miles from home and friends and family, it was our spiritual center. And we just want to thank you all for Nelly for that. Happy anniversary. Yeah, you know, just like the, the Bible school, the worship, the, the spiritual input, and yeah, you know, the personal input, like from Wolfgang Ellie and others as well, and just really strengthened me like spiritually. And then I was able, to, like, I was, I was able to put back, and like we went on a lot of like missions, like spent times on the street. Um, I remember going to China and also to um, to Dublin, like with a couple of the guys. And yeah, I just hope and really pray that the seeds that were sown in those years, all, all the time we grew, like back then will bear much fruit in years to come. I just say thank you and my best you in years going forward. Amen. <laughs> when I think about my time at uh, His People, Every Nation London, um, I'm really thankful to the Lord for great leadership. Uh, it was really a time when I understood for the first time what spiritual family is all about and I had strong foundations in my faith built there from Bible school. I was baptized in that year in 2001 and just really got involved in cell, in, in uh, youth ministry with Margot and uh, Torsten and the guys, Graham and Tammy. So I'm really thankful that was the first time that I really understood what spiritual family is about. And then in 2002, I was released to China for 10 years. And just really from those foundations in London, I believe that's why I was able to go to China and, and uh, just be led by the Lord to do the things that were done there. So just from Africa. When I think of what I'm grateful for, for every nation, it definitely has to be Wolfie and Ali and the amazing teaching and preaching that they have given us over the years. And not just from the front in the services, but in leadership trainings and one-on-one. Um, -on -one. We are so grateful for the foundation that you've laid in our lives and we really have not experienced it in any, any other form in the two years that we've been in South Africa, anything like the, the caliber of teaching and preaching that, that we got from you guys. So we just, we're so thankful for that and just that foundation that you've laid. Yeah, and I just agree as well. Thank you for allowing us to dream and to follow our dreams that God has given us. And we're just so grateful. Um, everything we've learned through Bible school and just through all the, the teaching and through the friends that we've made and just the church as a whole, it's just been uh, such a blessing to us and it's certainly a foundation as to what we're doing now here in South Africa. Um, thank you so much. We love you guys. We miss everybody. Bye. When I think of my time in Every Nation London, I'm thankful to the Lord for being taught and instructed and challenged to honour God and advance His kingdom. I'm thankful for my home in the heart of London for Wolfie, for Franz, for Tos, for the love, friendship, discipleship, oh, for the discipleship, um, for the tears that went with that, and the hugs, and the tea, and I'm thankful for all of you guys that are still there serving and running with a vision in the greatest city in the world.